Hello and welcome to jkkmobile.com. As I showed you on my first uh, impression video, the apps sometimes on the Galaxy Tab don't uh, take the whole screen. So let me show you some racing. Let's do... No, this one actually fits the screen, but the racing game doesn't. And uh, that's a problem. You don't see the full screen on the game, so that sucks big time, of course. We have 7 inches here, I would love to use the whole 7 inches. Same goes with, uh, with our dear friends at Engadget, their app also doesn't take the advantage of the full screen. Not nice. But there is really easy solution for that. You go to Android Market, you search for spare parts. That's easy, right? Spare parts app, you install that, I've already done that, but you do that, and then you launch it. So, spare parts, as, as you can see, it also doesn't fit the screen. So, you scroll a bit down to compatibility mode. It's already there, but you have to first untap it and then tap again, then go back, and then you have to reboot the tab. So let's do that. And remember, you have to do exactly like this, or it would take multiple reboots to, to work. So please follow the instructions. This way you can get all the apps to run full screen. This is kind of stupid, of course, uh, first on first part from the designer uh, or developer perspective, they should use the whole screen, but also from the manufacturer, uh, Samsung, uh, respect, because they have uh, set the comp compatibility mode on. So this is really easy way to, to do this. Just let's, let's wait it to boot. It's quite, quite fast to boot, but always feels like forever when you, when you want to see the results. So come on, Samsung. Okay. Come on, come on, go, go, go. Then let's go back to the... Let's wait the stuff to load. Load, load, load. No? No? Few more seconds, hopefully seconds. Media scan running apps. Okay, there we go. So let's try to find the spare parts there. And now... Let's go again, same place, compatibility mode, and now untap that. And again away, and then again reboot. Okay. Rebooting, especially watching rebooting on video, that's always fun, right? But only a few seconds now, let's boot it up. By the way, I've been really having fun with this, and, and ha I have several other stuff coming soon, so on my next videos I will show you, show you how to root this, and also why you should root, and, and also how to easily take advantage of the rooting, so let's do that later. But right now, hopefully we right now get to the desktop, and then to the spare parts app, and this time it should be full screen. Come on, load it now. You saw this uh, opening screen coming behind a lot, but typically, of course, it's not like that. It's just now when it's when it's booting. So now let's wait for the apps to appear. Again, this is just just happening when when you're rebooting. Typically, we get there really fast. So. Spare parts is now on full screen. There is other settings too, but be careful using those. But there are other other nice settings, so use them if you wish. But now everything is working fine. Let's now open the our dear friends at Engadget should be happy now because their app is on full screen too. And let's see if there's any cool news. Mm, oh, that's a cool news. Galaxy Tab is dissected. Oh, that's my, my video actually. <laughs> but anyways, now we can also enjoy some racing on full screen. 
as you can see oops where did I go start single player quick race okay let's do some and it works full screen it didn't work before so quite a good hack well this is actually not a hack this is just a setting thing so galaxy tab on full screen is go everything works just like it should be and uh, now I go to test some more stuff so subscribe to jkmobile.com subscribe to my site and if you want to follow me on twitter it's twitter.com jkmobile because I'm gonna play with this device and I'm gonna gonna try to make it a bit better also try to hack it a bit bit and uh, well I won't be telling everything now so jkmobile.com thank you bye